On this installment of Georgia Grown's Pick, Cook, Keep, we'll look at a juicy little berry whose health benefits are equally matched by its delicious taste, the blueberry. Tracks of South Georgia farmland once known for growing tobacco now serve as fertile soil for this healthy and versatile berry that can be enjoyed by the handful or incorporated into endless delicious recipes. Hello, I'm Dave Schneider with Halyards and Tremecha Restaurants on St. Simons Island. We're here to talk about Georgia Grown and all the things that we can celebrate with the Georgia Bounty that's out and about. Uh, what we're going to make today is a blueberry vinaigrette and one salad that's delicious in the summertime is an arugula salad. We've got from Brantley County and uh, Vince Baker's Farm is some delicious arugula. We're going to toss it with some shallots, some toasted pecans, don't forget to toast them off. A little bit of great salty pungent blue cheese or gorgonzola cheese. We're going to mix that all together with a blueberry vinaigrette. So what we've got from Lanier County are some delicious blueberries. And for a little bit of acidity we've got some tamarind paste and tamarind paste gives that nice sweet and sour feel. We've got some delicious sorghum. If you can't find any sorghum, feel free to use honey. But the sorghum's got that little bit of that nutty flavor, a little bit of pine in it. It's just absolutely delicious. And of course, from Georgia, got a little bit of red wine vinegar, some salt, a little bit of pepper. And I always like a little bit extra. And we're going to finish it off with some Georgia Olive Farms extra virgin olive oil. And just to bring it all together, we're going to put it in the blender. And then again, for whatever you find delicious, you can add a little bit or take away a little bit and just put it right on your salad. Your finished product is this wonderful arugula salad with toasted pecans, gorgonzola cheese, and of course the blueberry vinaigrette we just made. Please remember to support your Georgia family farms. If you'd like to freeze some of those fresh blueberries, place the unwashed berries on a cookie sheet or a flat pan. Place the pan into the freezer. After freezing overnight, remove the pan and put the frozen berries into your favorite freezer bags for storage. When you're ready to use the blueberries, remove them from the bag, wash them in cold water, and you'll be ready to enjoy something tasty and Georgia-grown.